In 1982, scientist Dan Schechtman discovered something that would shake the foundations of crystallography, patterns in metals that were ordered but never exactly repeated themselves. Unlike traditional crystals with their perfectly repeating patterns, these quasi-crystals displayed five-fold symmetry, something that was thought to be mathematically impossible in nature. This discovery was so controversial that Schechtman was initially ridiculed by the scientific community with double Nobel laureate Linus Pauling declaring, there are no quasi-crystals, only quasi-scientists. The existence of quasi-crystals forced scientists to revise their very definition of what makes a crystal, expanding our understanding of how atoms can arrange themselves in solid matter. These remarkable structures have since been found both in the laboratory and in nature, including in a meteorite that formed during the early days of our solar system. Today, quasi-crystals are being explored for practical applications, from non-stick coatings to more efficient solar cells, proving that sometimes the most revolutionary discoveries come from questioning our most basic assumptions.